Okay, so here's the EchoFlow app. I'm going to get it for my River 600. So we'll see how this works. This is how you control some of the fan settings and some of the other features um, that come with the EchoFlow. And so let's just take a look and see what we get here. Okay, I'm going to allow that. Um, I'm actually going to allow the alerts for now. Nice, works with multiple devices. Check the status, looks good. Um, let's see, we're going to need to do a sign up. So now I'm going to push this button down here, the reset. IOT reset button for three seconds. One, two, three. If I did that for three seconds. One, two, three. Okay, it's beeping. It looks like it's looking. Okay, so I've got to add a device here and turn on to restore. Please hold for more than three seconds. Go to your phone settings and then Wi Fi and turn on Wi Fi. Okay, so let's get over here and Wi Fi. There it is. Okay, and then go back to the app. Okay, so we're back here. So we got to find uh, network. And uh, It's not good because it doesn't look like it's finding our, our network. So I'm going to try to move it a little closer here. I'm going to go back. Let's see. So maybe if I can find it again. There it is. And I'll hit here. Okay, there it is. So now if I click on this, um, looks like I have some options. I'm actually going to bring the device back over here closer to me. And uh, let's see what we have. So it's at 100%. You can change the light there, just turn the light on. Turn the AC on. DC, that works all great. Put the frequency. If I want that X boost to work. So I think if I turn that off, oops, and now I turn the AC on. Oh, that fan's still running. So I'm going to turn that back on. Um, let's go back here. 
battery. Let's see what we have. System. And how long does it go before it goes on standby? I'm actually going to turn that down to about an hour because I'm going to be messing around with stuff. Um, we'll use Fahrenheit. Let's see. So you can turn down the fan, but it takes five times longer than usual. So Okay, well, so there's no point, unless you really want it quiet, you can turn that off. So your DC mode, it has an MPPT uh, invert, uh, charge controller, so that's great. So, um, yeah, it looks like the best way is just to leave it auto, beep. Yeah, we'll do that. And let's see what version we have. Let's see if there's any updates. We'll go ahead and run that. So the fan just turned off here um, so we'll see you know we're not really using the device exit this page or the app will not affect oh it probably means of. Exit, exiting this page of the app will not affect the upgrading process. So that means you can go out of here if you want. That's not going to be a problem. So, um, there's an option here on the user settings, but that's pretty much it. We'll see how it goes.